Hey guys, welcome back to NFT Inspo. For today's video, we are going to show you how to fix Shopify visual stability. So if you're interested, let's start a tutorial. Now in this case, there are multiple ways to basically fix the Shopify visual stability on your store. So one of them is to optimize your images. So first is to reach, uh, resize your images. So make sure all the pictures that you use on your website are adjusted to the right size before putting them on Shopify. This makes the files smaller and helps with the load or helps them load faster. Also, lazy loading. So some Shopify teams have a feature called lazy loading. It means that pictures outside of what you're currently looking at won't load until you scroll to them. This makes the first page load faster. Now, another technique that you could do here is to reserve space for elements. If there are things on your site that makes a while, takes a while to load, well, like ads or videos, use CSS to set aside space for them. So this stops everything from moving around while they load. Minimize flashing content is a great technique as well. So don't use things that blink or change size quickly because they can be distracting and make your site look unstable. Also, front optimization. Choose web fonts carefully so they load consistently and don't mess up how your page looks. Also, there is team considerations. So team code is a great team code review is a great way for you to uh, basically uh, optimize your website. So if you're good with coding, check your team's code for any scripts that might make things move around. Now, also some teams are actually take a while to load up. So considering changing teams if you want to. Also, check your third-party apps. So in this case, temporarily disable some of the apps that you have. So if you've added an extra feature for your site recently and things got wonky or they're actually pretty, uh, they're not stable, well, in this case, try turning them off for a bit and see if that helps. Now, if that actually helps, it means that the app itself or the, or the third-party app that you installed is the one causing the problem itself. So you might need to look for alternatives. Also, prioritize view for channel content focus on making sure the stuff you see first on your page loads quickly and looks good and that's about it so hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to nft inspo thank you for watching